There's no doubt about it. Chris built this machine to teleport himself to Sonic's world. Then let's use it to find him. Unfortunately, Chris seems to have designed the machine so that nobody but him could be teleported. What? Can't you reprogram it? Oh. Oh. There is one thing. Even though we can't teleport ourselves, it seems we can use the machine to teleport material objects to Sonic's world. Really? <gasps> yes. Get the phone. Uh, uh, ah, that's not what I meant. You better answer before they hang up. You little! I already told you the check's in the mail. Victor, is that you? Ah, Cream's mother. How've you been? I'm calling because I need your help. My agency's at your service, ma'am. I'd like to explain the job to you in person. Sure, we'll come over right away. Ah. <laughs> What are you laughing at? Uh. <laughs> hey, don't cry. <laughs> okay. Now, where's Espio? He's right there. Get me the pepper mill. Sure, boss. <laughs> <laughs> Can't you buy an alarm clock? All of this suddenly appeared out of nowhere. Chris's family must have sent his belongings. He's traveling in space with Cream, and I was hoping you could deliver these things to their ship. And please check on Cream. I've been worried about her. Don't worry, ma'am. We'll take care of it, no problem. Vector. What's the matter? We can't do this job. How come? If you think we're cruising the galaxy without a ship, you're spaced out. Where can we get a ship? Looks like that problem solved. I hope you boys have a safe trip. It looks peaceful out there. No sign of any Metarex. <laughs> It's nice to travel in space when you can take the time to stargaze. They really are beautiful. Why don't you move your king? Well, call me when you make your move. I'm gonna go for a run. Uh, uh, that's check, huh? Where'd Sonic go? Uh, 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 uh. Hey, Sonic! It's your move! You're not giving up, are ya? Whoa. Sonic! Whoa. That's just great. Sonic can't get back, so somebody has to go after him. Say what? Sonic can't get back to the ship? And he's getting farther away from us every second! Ah! We have to go rescue him now! I know, 
but how will we get to him? Think of something fast before he's out of reach! I've got an idea, but first we need to find a rope. Hang in there, Sonic, I'm coming! That ship will catch up to us soon. Who are they? We can't be sure yet, but they're probably Metarex. Our sensors aren't picking up any weapons on the ship. Do you know where Sonic and Knuckles are? Sonic slipped off the ship, so Knuckles had to take a rocket pack and go rescue him. <gasps> but we could have gone after him in the Blue Typhoon! Right now, we have to worry about getting this ship battle ready. That other ship is definitely trying to intercept us. What if they board our ship? We'll be ready! I wish we knew how to use the ship's communicator. I guess we'll just have to surprise them. What a chip. Stay out of those boxes. Espio's right! We was hired to deliver that stuff, not devour it! I'm gonna go let them know we're here! Which way's the bridge? Must be that way. All right, everybody get ready. Hello? Anybody there? I've come to... I haven't got this beat up since the time we staked out that shark tank. Really? You mean those guys attacked you? I think it would be better if I handled this. What a mess. It's lucky that Metarex didn't get past us, or it could have wrecked the whole ship. Huh? Uh-oh. Ah! Oh, Amy! What's going on? L look! Oh. It's an invisible Metarex! Let's get it! I am in pain. <laughs> Looks like you're in paint, too. I can't believe I was discovered so easily. I'm so humiliated, I wish I could disappear. Maybe they'll listen to me, Vector. You sure? I won't let you down. Just be sure to protect yourself, Charmy. It's dangerous in there. I know. Snack time, everybody. We've got tea and cake. Wow, perfect timing. I was just starting to get hungry. This looks delicious. What kind of cake is it? I call it cream strawberry cream cake. I made it myself. I vote that we make cream the chef of the ship. She can make cake for every meal. <laughs> <laughs> Did somebody say cake? It's a matter of Let's get it. Yeah! yeah! Charge! <laughs> it's totally unfair. We came in peace and got torn to pieces. Yeah, we flew across the galaxy to help these guys. I didn't expect a party, but they didn't have to treat us like pinatas. They are most ungrateful, but I will not step quietly through the door of defeat. I say we head for home pronto. We ain't gonna give up yet, Charmy. The reputation of our agency is at stake, and we're gonna do the job we was hired to do. We're gonna board their ship again, and this time we'll succeed, because I'm totally fired up! And, well, I'm getting warmed up. Let's go cool off and think of a strategy. I mean, there's no rush or anything, right? Huh? Come on, let's take a coffee break. Huh? Do you see something? Looks like the Metarex are taking off. They're escaping? Don't worry, I'll go stop them in the X tornado. Uh, you're really gonna go after them all by yourself? Relax, you said yourself that ship doesn't have any weapons on it. That's right! I guess if they're retreating, they can't be very tough. Huh? You know, my snout's starting to feel kind of stuffed up. I wonder if I'm getting a cold. Maybe you're just allergic to space.
looks familiar. It couldn't be. Hey, it's okay, you guys. We didn't know it was you. Looks like he wants to negotiate. Should we talk? It's probably just some sort of ruse. Espio's right. I bet they're trying to trick us. Nobody tricks me! Hold on to your seats, boys. We're gonna shake these turkeys. Here we go! They're too fast. I'll never be able to catch them in the X-Tornado. I saw everything. Looks like that ship's gonna be harder to stop than you thought. Yeah, you'll have to catch him in the Blue Typhoon after all. Will do. Once you catch up to him, try grabbing onto the hull of their ship with the mechanical claw. I've been wanting to use that. Hold on, everybody. We're gonna pull a quick 180. Let's catch those Metarex. Uh, correction, Chris. That isn't a Metarex ship after all. Then who are they? Ah. What is it, Charmy? It looks like they're trying to chase us down. Uh, no way! See? Well, uh, I'll bust this bucket space drive trying to escape if I have to! Vector, no. <laughs> Slow down, Vector. No, speed it up! We stopped. I didn't do it. So then, how'd we stop? I've completed the capture tails. I'm bringing the ship in. It's Vector, Espio, and Charmy. Their radio must be broken or something. Huh? You mean it wasn't a Metarex? <laughs> We're sorry, you guys. Sorry. Hmm. Well, at least it's all settled now. We forgive you. It was just a big misunderstanding. Let bygones be bygones. <sighs> Why don't you help us unload the stuff Chris's family sent for him? <laughs> they sure went to a lot of trouble. <sighs> I think that's everything. Thanks, Vector. I'll do all the unpacking and stuff myself. Great! Grandpa must have found a way to teleport these things from home. I'm sure Mom and Dad are worried about me. They don't even know if I made it here, okay? I wish I could find a way to tell them I'm all right. Charmy means to say is we must be leaving. Hang on, SPO. These folks are offering us their hospitality. We don't want to be rude, do we? <laughs> Victor, would you like thirds? You bet. By the way, Cream. Yes, Victor? Creamy, I hope you'll forgive me if I sound just like a nosy old croc. Huh? But are you sure you should be playing around in space? I'm not playing around. I'm helping save the universe. I don't think you realize what's at stake here, Vector. We're on a mission to stop the Metarex. It's serious business. Maybe it is, but I think Cream's mother wants Cream to come home. My mother doesn't want that. She trusts me because she knows that I'm here to help my friends. Come on, Cosmo. Why did you say that, Vector? Cream's mother didn't tell us to bring the girl home. She told us to check on her. Yeah, that's what she told us, but she was trying to be strong. She was really thinking. I'm so worried about my little baby. You've got to save her, Vector. She's too young to be out there all alone. Hold on. Cream's mother never said that. She thought it, and I'm a detective. So I detected it. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another episode of Delusional Thinking with Vector. We're taking Cream with us. But Vector... No buts about it! I made a solemn promise to Cream's mama, and I ain't going back on my word! You never made any promise. <clears throat> I made a promise, you just didn't hear it! Because <sighs> I made it from the bottom of my heart! This is hopeless. I can't argue with someone who refuses to make sense. I'm tossing Cream into this bag, and then we're gone! Just look at him go, ladies and gentlemen! He's out of control! There's no stopping him! 
doesn't look like we're gonna find any Chaos Emeralds around here. I agree. Since there aren't many planets around here, the Emeralds wouldn't be drawn this way. Why's that, Tails? Chaos Emeralds are attracted by the gravitational uh, fields around uh -huh. planets. Uh -huh. I see. I think we better go search someplace else. Time for us to skedaddle, folks! Uh -huh. <laughs> you sure you don't want to travel with us a little? We can use all the help we can get battling the Metarax. We will fight with you in spirit. That won't do us much good. Keep up the good work! The galaxy appreciates your heroic efforts! Catch you later! Well, that was fun. Hey, where did Cream and Cheese go? Huh? Cosmo was here too, wasn't she? They were here until Vector and his gang showed up to say goodbye. What do you think you're doing, Choo Choo? You're going back to your mama. And I am too. How'd you get in there? You didn't think I was just going to let you take cream, did you? Well, I'm not going to. This don't have nothing to do with you, Missy. <laughs> no stowaways allowed on this ship. <laughs> you are taking me back and taking cream too. <laughs> Vector. I want to play, too. <laughs> Maybe well, not. Well, don't just... Uh, what is it? We've got company! Huh? I'll handle it this time. <laughs> One, two, three. <laughs> well, that kind of worked. They just broke the ship's claw. Well, there's got to be some way to catch him. We can't let him get away with Cosmo cream and cheese. Let me try to get the backup claw working. I thought I was going to run out of rope. Thanks a bunch, Knuckles. Huh. Gotta fly. I'll see you back at the ship. Uh, Sonic! So can you get it to work? I think, but it'll take a little ingenuity on Chris's part. No problem. Sonic! We were worried about you. Think you can catch a ship while you're out there? Huh? Vector took Cosmo cream and cheese. Come on, give me more speed! I don't know what this is about, but Cream and the others are coming with me. I don't want to fight you, Sonic, but I said I'd bring little Cream back home to her mama, and nobody's going to stop me. Let her go, or you'll be sorry. Oh, yeah? It's lucky for you that you're blue, because nobody's going to notice all your bruises when I'm done whooping you. Now put up your dukes. <laughs> is this what you meant to do? <laughs> There's plenty more where that came from. Will you please stop fighting? Don't you understand? Only one of us can decide what Cream should do. Cosmo's right. Cream's mom may worry about her and want her to come home, and we may want her to keep traveling with us. But we don't get to choose what Cream does. Only Cream can decide that. Sorry, kid, but you know how parents are. Believe me, Vector, I do. But still. So what's it gonna be, Cream? I want to stay here and help because it's important to me. I'm sure my mom's worried, but I also think she trusts me to do the right thing. <sighs> SBO, Charmy, we're out of here. Our mission has been accomplished, guys. Huh? Aren't we supposed to take Cream? We were sent to make sure Cream was okay, and that's what we've done. Hey, Cream. Yeah? Be sure to drop your mother a line from time to time. I will. <laughs> What could that be? Hmm. I miss you, Cream, but I know you're doing something important. No Chaos Emeralds in this area. Why is that capsule here? No. It couldn't be. Hedgehog around Gotta 